hello everyone so most of you might have been preparing for your next job role or for your next uh, assignment on sap mm so might have been you are preparing for the interview so it is better to be well prepared for the interview right so that it will be helpful for you to get your job easily so in today's topic we are going to discuss how to prepare well for an upcoming sap mm interview so you can relate it with other modules also so it is pretty much of a kind of basic but it will be related to sap mm because the topic which we will be discussing on the subjective point of view it will be related to your sap mm itself okay so let's start so first and foremost it is very important to prepare on the introduction right so every interview will start or will crack with the introduction part so you might have been uh, thinking that introduction will not be that much of important but every time it is a very important one because so if your introduction goes well then your interview will also go well so right away prepare for a introduction means it's a kind of pretty basic but you have to prepare it good okay so you need to uh, mention your experiences your backgrounds your educational background whatever things you may think or you might think that it is going to add some values to your interview process or for your job process so you have to include all of those things in your introduction so might be you can say what are let's say current experiences you you are having or uh, let's say whatever things you have worked on uh, let's say on the mm prospective or whatever module you are preparing for on those prospective whatever experiences you have okay so basically we are discussing this for a experience prospective in the next session or in some session we were, we might go for a fresher interview preparation we might go for that one so basically as a experienced professional you have to tell whatever experiences you have total years of experience what is your background or uh, let's say what is your current profile where you are working currently and what is the current work scenario is so everything you have to mention in your introduction and which area you are strong at so those kind of things also you can include in your introduction so everyone will have a different aspect of in uh, let's say inter, um, introduction but you have to prepare your own and you have to include these kind of things let's say work experiences what is your strong point what are your knowledges what you um, any kind of trainings you have undergone so these kind of things you should include in your introduction so after the introduction so next your interview will start okay so your interview will start asking questions so where he will be asking you questions so basically all of your questions will be coming from your resume whatever things you have mentioned in your resume that will be coming from that okay so you need to prepare your resume very well so whatever things you are very good at or you are having a very good knowledge you have to put those kind of things in your resume okay so basically or mostly if i tell you so first thing for the sap mm let's say let's take an example of sap mm so for that first and foremost you have to be very confident on the procurement processes so there are a lot of procurement process or business processes are there in sap mm so basically and uh, mostly what is very important that is a p2p cycle that is a sto scenario and uh, that's it that is a subcontracting process and uh, that is a consignment process so these kind of processes are very much of important so you need to be very confident on these process and not only on this process but you have to be very particular about the accounting entries also okay so prepare the process along with the accounting entries okay so you have to prepare likewise and uh, then comes to your 
procedure so in sap mm we have some procedure let's say pricing procedure let's say release procedure let's say output determination and uh, accounting determination these are the four types of procedure that we have very important so in every interview on any interview these are the specific questions everyone will ask you related to pricing procedure accounting determination might be release procedure and uh, output determination maybe someone will not ask you but definitely pricing and accounting determination everyone is going to ask you so we very confident on that one prepare very well on these topics okay so next one you might be getting asked about the tables so what are the basic tables so um, you have to prepare on the material master table you have to prepare on the uh, let's say purchasing tables you have to prepare on the um, let's say any other tables are there you need to prepare on those kind of tables let's say goods receipt tables what are the tables and uh, accounting entries tables or uh, let's say what is the um, uh, accounting document tables are there so you have to prepare on the tables also so last thing you have to prepare on the accounting entries so as i have said you have to prepare the process along with the accounting entries so accounting entries is a very important aspect of uh, sap mm because it is an integral part it is an integration part between mm and fi so you need to be very confident or you need to know all of the things related to this type of topic so these are related to your subjective part so whatever things you need to prepare on the subjective part next next comes to your work experience or your working profile under that one you need to be very sure about the what are the let's say some of the tickets will be there okay whatever tickets or whatever issues you might have handled whatever the things or challenges you might have faced in your current working process or whatever the rules and responsibility are there so these kind of questions will be asked in the interview so you need to prepare on that one also so what are the critical incident what are the critical uh, things you have handled or what are the challenges you have handled so these kind of questions you might get asked okay so and uh, one more thing is there you need to prepare on the uh, so mostly uh, in some interviews they will be asking not on the basic not on the standard process also and they will be asking you about some scenario based question why do they ask on the scenario based question because we are in a field of consulting we are not uh, like uh, ticket resolver or we are not going to resolve the standard ticket but we need to understand the process and we need to understand the requirement of the business because there are many type business needs to develop something or they need to enhance something so for that one you need to understand the process and you need to know what is the solution what may be the solution you have to analyze that one so that's why in every interview or any interview they will be asking you a scenario based question it might be related to purchasing it might be related to your pricing procedure or it might be related to any other topic so you need to be very confident and very let's say um, prepare very well on that topic so that any kind of scenario comes you can uh, analyze on your own and you can just provide an answer like there is nothing right and nothing wrong so you can just um, like if you have something if you know something then definitely you can answer like uh, your uh, own prospect you can uh, analyze your analysis you can give in give on that let's say what might be the solution that might be wrong or right that is not a, a problem but if you are uh, able to analyze that what can be the issue what can be the solution then definitely you should answer okay so these are the some topics or these are some points on which you can prepare on your interview and uh, on your next interview you can prepare very well on these kind of topics so all the very best for your interview if you still having any doubt then you can ask in the comment section or if you have joined the um, whatsapp group there also you can ask if you have any topics you uh, want to ask then you can ask over there and uh, i'll be sharing a consolidated uh, questions of uh, whatever may be the probable or possible question that you might get on um, interviews so 
I'll be sharing it on uh, might be it will be shared on LinkedIn or might be shared on the WhatsApp so you can join both you can follow me on uh, LinkedIn also there you can get some topics you can get some questions over there and uh, that's it for today so all the very best for your upcoming interview and uh, definitely one more thing I would uh, suggest you so if you are preparing for the interview go for a mock interview session okay so mock interview session also we are taking it uh, free of cost so if you are inter interested for a mock interview session then just uh, ping me on whatsapp uh, and uh, share your resume so we will be uh, find a suitable slot for you the where we can take the mock interview so basically you can prepare and you can uh, get checked like what is your preparation stage or wh where you are lacking or what you need to prepare more that will be a check at that point of time okay so if you are planning for a mock interview definitely ping me on whatsapp so that's it for today let's meet up again with some other topic so till then bye bye and jai hind